Hi, this is Susan from Tango Boutique, and I want to show you how to add some holes to your straps. Now sometimes this is necessary when the straps come very long, or if you have a very high or very low arch. So in order to add some new holes, you need a hole punch. These are available online, they're very inexpensive, and we'll have a link in our blog where you can find a place to purchase a hole punch like this one. You have to make sure that the punch has a rather small hole so that you don't have flapping around when you're trying to dance. So you can also see if your instructor has a hole punch or uh, if your cobbler will punch a hole for you. When you're making the holes, you have to go from the top to the bottom because there are chafts that will stick on the bottom of the strap. So you want to start at the top and you, you lightly push down and then look at the strap from all angles to make sure you truly are in the center of the strap. When you make a punch, you can see there's a little bit of a shaft and you might like to cut that off later. So you punch along trying to keep your holes about equal to the ones that are already on the shoe. This time sometimes it creates a strap that's too long and you need to trim the end. So take a good sharp pair of scissors and trim at the same angle. The straps are made to withstand this kind of treatment so they don't fray. You should be able to still have years of use with your strap and then you just Add your buckle back onto your strap using one of your new holes. And there you go. You're off and dancing. Thanks for watching and check us out at thetangoboutique.com.